Kutumi ya taifa ya ardhi mifutili mbali hati miliki za ardhi mbili zinazo milikiwa na shirika la huduma kwa wanyamapori nchini KWS. Hii ni kulingana na baada ya kunyakuliwa kwa ardhi hiyo na mwanabiashara mmoja katika eneo la Malindi. Mwenyekiti wa tume hiyo Dr. Muhammad Swazuri ameamrisha uh, tume au shirika la KWS kunradhi kuweka uzio wake kwenye ardhi hiyo ili kuwazuia wanyakuzi wa ardhi. Mwanabari wetu Jeff Haimba anatuarifu zaidi. Mwenyekiti wa tume ya ardhi njini Dr. Muhammad Swazura alitoa amri ya kufuti ya mbali hatimiliki hizo baada kuzuru mashamba hayo yalionyakuliwa. First one is uh, at the county commissioner deputy county commissioner's office that tall mat story building there next to the county assembly. That plot you see behind there is all KWS land. It's five acres of the land. Uh, it was subdivided uh, regularly, uh, but the people never came on the ground into 11 plots. Inadaiwa kwamba KWS ilinunua ardhi hizo zenye ekari tano mnamu mwaka miakenda themanini karibu na bonge la county ya kilifi. Swazuri alisema kuwa licha ardhi hiyo kugawanywa kwa vipanda kumina moja. Fanyi biashara mmoja likatika kampuni ya Mixed Match, aliweza kunyakuwa vipanda tatu na kuzichukulia hati miliki. Aida alisema kuwa vipande vingine vinane vya ardhi havija guswa na kuwa vitalindwa vikamilifu. The 8 of the 11 letters of allotment were cancelled. Three people had got titles which have been restricted and uh, as we have come here to declare that those titles are already revoked because they are on public land. That land was given to was bought in 1980 by KWS using their own funds. The titles that we are talking about were procured in 1992, so it is illegal. They should not have been given those titles, so we are revoking those three titles because they are on public land. Tume hiyo ya ardhi ilisema kuwa itendelea kulinda mali na kurejesha mashamba yale onyakuliwa na waporaji. Nikiripoti ya muanga wa Ibro TV, jina langu ni Jeff Haemba.